안녕 하세요. I'm learning Korean. And I just watched the movie Saltburn. It was crazy. I recommend it. I think it was crazy. I'm still fucked up about it. Um, it's been my birthday. It's been the winter solstice. And 48 minutes ago, it was Christmas. Um, Merry Christmas to those who celebrate. Um, Adam and I do not. And that's who I'm facing today. Actually, I, I think he doesn't. Um, technically didn't confirm that, but I would assume he didn't. Um, we're facing Citrus, the Pidgey Pals. Um, uh, this last draft, um, he was my week one match. We giga lost to Dragon Dance Salamance, um, because I, I, well, I hadn't played Pokemon in a long time, and I kind of forgot Dragon Dance was a move. I was like, I think I literally say in the video, like, quote, he can't Swords Dance and Agility in the same turn, and then he does that. Yeah, kind of is unfortunate. Do I just press Toxic and leave? This is the kill resets, right? This is fucking Samira. The Pokemon's attack is raised by one stage of Chaos, another Pokemon. What if I go... He has either, what, Swords Dance or Agility or something? Can't remember. Maybe Agility. Click Toxic? Right. Um, some, I, I say something to that effect, which is very funny. Um, and now reverses him again. His team has also gone undergone a lot of changes, and by a lot, I mean, I think, two? Um, where did I check that? Oh, Citrus has made three changes, so... Oh yeah, he had, uh, H-Arc-9, Zerud, oh, the Grass Dark type. Oh wait, he doesn't have Blastoise anymore? Oh, so I just prepped for him with Blastoise, but he has a Zumarill. So let me make that quick change and see how much that changes, because Zumarill is kind of scary. Um... Okay. What that changes is... Um... That's the same. Poison. You're only weak to water, to, to electric and poison. Well, I'm bringing Zerora anyway. Um. Uh. Well, you're probably still weak to grass, because no way you're not bringing huge power Az Azumarill, right? What's the point of bringing Azumarill without huge power? Let me look it up. Hang on. Uh. Uh. -uh. I think it's going to be fine, but that does make it scarier for my potential plan of trying to sweep with um, Altaria. You're never not bringing huge power, right? I mean, it's draft, so you might. But I'm going to work on the assumption that he's not bringing it. Anyway, we're just wrapping up team building here. Um... The scary threats on his team that I am keeping in mind are, well, honestly, his team, when he finished drafting his team, I was like, none of these Pokemon seem like the star, you know what I mean? Like, when you, when you, I think, draft, I think when you draft, you want to have a Pokemon that is the star of your team, or is the, you know, cornerstone of... You can build a team around one Pokemon doing everything, kind of. So, you know, it's easy to go through. I mean, Jonah, Mew. I mean, last time it was kind of Garchomp as well. This time, he has a lot of Pokemon that can do that. I think last time, less so. Um, for my team, it's obviously Zerora, but also um, Mega Altaria and Landorus are giant threats that you have to think about when you're building versus me. Um... Not that my entire team is, like, bad or something, but those are kind of the, like, threats that are, like, okay, I can't let that Pokemon get out of control. Um, and last time it was Dragapult, obviously, as well as kind of Tinglu doing an unexpected amount of work alongside Palmot. Um, but that's enough of a history lesson, enough of a draft philosophy lesson. Looking at the matchup, I have the outspeed, which is kind of what I love to do with my first pick in draft, just get a Pokemon with crazy speed um, that can kind of... I mean, I mean, Zero and Dragapult are similar in that they're both potentially mixed attackers with a strong 
um, offensive stab physical move that, uh, you know, they're 142 speed and 143 speed. And I don't think a 144 speed Pokemon exists yet, but draft three, never know what could happen in the meantime. Um, to explain my draft, or to explain the team I'm bringing, rather, um, we really place. I was, this was originally Landorus and Corviknight, and I'm not bringing it because his team is too good with electric attacks, fire attacks, uh, probably Heat Wave coming on this thing, just because it's like, it doesn't have that many good moves. Latias can bring Thunderbolt, um, I think Wigglytuff has Thunderbolt, and I think Copperaja could be a sleeper problem for me, as well as Ditto, I want to make sure I get Ditto out of the way before I bring in Altaria. Um, because Altaria is a setup Pokemon for me. I'm bringing this crazy Altaria set that I've tested before, um, where you're truly just bringing Return as your only damage move, and you're just, you, you, you get Altaria on the field, click Cotton Guard, and you're hope, you're, you're just hoping to die to nothing. And when we, let's do this, Altaria Mega versus Shiyu. So I do get a uh, um, a turn versus Chiu, essentially. Um, what are my current EVs? 156. So I, I know I still live, but I'm just like, what if I just did 252? I mean, I could do like... Oh no, that doesn't even necessarily... What if I do... Um, careful. Nah. So I can't even hypothetically survive... 252 plus special attacks, choice specs, speeds of ruin, terra heat, in sun, terrifier in sun, chi overheat, uh, critical hit. I, I don't know. I love that meme of like chi with every damage boost possible. Um, th there should be like choice specs, nasty plot. Like, <laughs> um, yeah. So this Pokemon not necessarily equipped to deal with chi unless I get a lucky switch in. I'm also not playing with hazards, but I am bringing Komala as my um, you know, hazard, hazard preventer. Komala can also kill Chiyu with superpower. Um, I'm kind of playing, like, unworried versus, um, unworried about Pidgeot. That might come back to bite me, but I just feel like I have Zerora, and I think I should bring a super effective attack for Pidgeot. Oh my god, I can't get my tabs in order. Um, on Miss Magius, which would be Power Gem probably, because I can also hit Chi with it, and Frostmoth if no Terra, but I'm thinking he might bring Ground Terra or Water Terra Frostmoth. Um, Frostmoth. <clears throat> so let's bring um, Power Gem. And I was gonna bring Icy Wind as well. Wouldn't that be, wouldn't that be cute, kind of? Let's see, let's see. So, Rock, Rock, Rock. I kill, um, I'm able to hit these three with Power Gem. Shadow Ball is hitting one, two, super effectively. And uh, Icy Wind is hitting one, two, that I wasn't previously hitting super effectively. Which does leave, leave a lot of the team. Maybe I bring Dazzling Gleam. What is, what is Ice doing here? One, two. Maybe I just bring Dazzling Gleam. Uh, let's do Dazzling Gleam. Um, Power Gem, Will-O-Wisp. I want to bring Will-O-Wisp because I'm building, uh... <coughs> I'm bringing everything specially defensive. Also, is Blunder Policy even really actually going to help? Let's say, because I'm just going to die to Overheat, I assume. And I will check. Miss Magius. What was this set? No item. Yeah. Overheat. Giga kills me, not to mention Dark Pulse. Um, oh, but do I bring Terra, Terra, um, oh, mm, uh, mm. Because I do outspeed. Okay, what if you go Terra Fighting? Terra Blast. That's, what? Wait, that's shit. Oh, wait. Okay, <laughs> that makes more sense. Uh, okay, 
It still doesn't kill. But if you're a uh, modest, still doesn't really kill. This thing shouldn't be equipped to kill Chiyu. It should be equipped to kill um, Pidgeot. Mega Pidgeot. Mega, Mega Pidgeot. Sure, whatever. Um, yeah, let's do this. Let's do Power Gem. That also does not fucking kill. Miss Magius. Maybe I don't bring this Pokemon. I kind of want to, though. Is that just stupid? Plus, I don't want to waste any more cit of Citrus's time. Um, and this video is already 10 minutes long. Um, let me finish specking this. Do I need to bring speed on Rotom? 298, outspeed Decidueye. Kind of feels important. 262. Yeah, I'll take it. Um, let's do... Uh, well, I'm not getting hit by Earthquake. Who are your physical attackers? Oh, well, Zygarde does have that ground move that can ground me. Mm. What, what? What? Look up a uh, Smogon Landorus. Yeah, he can bring Stone Edge. I mean, part of me feels like Landorus isn't going to come, but if it does, why am I feeling so unworried about it? Do I really think Tauros is going to handle it that easily? I don't know. I think I might just want to get the show on the road. I kind of have some kind of gut feeling that I'm going to lose. Adam just... I don't know, maybe he has my number. Who, who can say? Um, what do I want to bring? I think I don't need overheat investment because I'm only clicking it on... These two are definitely dying to uninvested overheat. Is Copperaja? Fine, I'll check. Are you tank? I mean, close enough, right? That's with no special attack investment and full special defense investment. And it still comes close to killing. Let's check, uh, what was the other one? Um, Decidueye. Overheat kills with how much investment? 20. I'll do 20. And the rest should be defensive or offensive. So Stone Edge is just going to kill me no matter what, so I'm not going to play for him. Uh, let's check. Zygarde, 10%. Choice Band, sure. Thousand Arrows, Giga Omega, triple, triple, one million kills. That's because I'm 4x effective. It's 4x effective since it ignores... Levitate, so forget that Pokemon as well. Forget that. So I'm not playing for either of the ground types. This is why you pick uh, Rotom Wash, by the way. Uh, Rotom Wash Giggle Walls Slanderous. <clears throat> Physical attackers. Physical attackers. This thing. And this thing. Yeah, I'll, I'll plug in Iron Hands. Whoops. Um, bum, bum. I'm fine with that. Wait, why does close combat destroy me? Well, yeah, that does make sense. But what if I have 252? All right. Yeah, so let's go. Let's go defensive then. Let's go like this, and like this, and like. Let's go... Mm, I could randomly invest in special defense with my nature. Mm. Yeah, okay. No real reason. Um, but sure. Let's check my team before I tell Adam that I'm ready. Acrobatics Air Balloon is so weird. This Pokemon is kind of dead weight on my team, but I'm, I'm expecting Tauros... And Altaria to do a lot of work. Um, the rest of my team does a lot of setting up for them. This Pokemon looks like shit. Why am I bringing this? Well... Maybe I have to bring Nasty Plot and fuck, fuck a Fairy-type move. 
This already gets hit by Ghost. Fairy here and Fairy here. Um... Not Choice Curve. Sure. This is just a will wisp bot. What else? What, what else can I bring that? Uh... Oh, Destiny Bond is interesting. Because I outspeed Chiyu, actually. Do I still want to bring a Rock type move? Not really. Well... <laughs> okay, I don't think I'm going to be in a situation where I need to kill this with a Rock-type attack. Destiny Bond. Who cares? Let's play for the cheese! And fuck this, we'll play maybe Leftovers instead. Oh wait, I need to finish EVs on that. Let's just do this. This this and check the f0 evs remaining on everything terra ice um assault vest tauros aqua kind of kind of kooky kind of crazy um yeah so let's see if i can get screens up because that would help my team a lot and if kaparaja isn't here then alteria can take off from the get-go basically except for the fact that landers can intimidate me at Adden. I'm ready! Exclamation points. Ugh. You know, I'm thinking to myself, I didn't want to fight Adam first, I wanted to fight Alex first, because I am excited for my match with Alex, but my match with Adam is just making me nervous. Hmm. Also, why am I to bring a water tip tack? These two? Yeah, okay, I don't need it. Um, because I'm bringing ice for Lando. And I'm bringing both fighting and ground for Chiyu, so it's just, I don't need water. Oh, wow. Let's hope Adam didn't go to sleep after I made him wait so long. Maybe I don't bring acrobatics. It's good versus, well, it goes unchecked is kind of the cool thing, right? I also have to remember, ooh, do I want to bring, wait, is he going to, hmm... He could lay down rocks pretty easily. Who's Who does rocks fuck on my team? Just you. And you're my lead anyway. So let's say he leads Landorus. Do I need an attack? Hmm. Should I bring Toxic or something instead of Volt Switch? For Lando? Or even Will-O-Wisp. Double Willow. If he leads Lando, and I enter with this... Damn, that's kind of weird for me. Why do you have Substitute, by the way? Well, if he tries to status something. It's also decent scouting. Do I want you to have a fighting type attack? Kind of. Kill this, kill the well, fighting isn't that amazing. Did Plasma Fist just kill Chiyu outright? Um No, it does not. Okay, so why are you not bringing let's look at Drain Punch. Doesn't kill. Um then yeah, why aren't you bringing close combat? I guess would be my would be my question. And do I ever invest forty into special def? Oh, oh, two sixteen. Okay, so I can't not get killed by overheat. Um. Just four attacking moves. One of these surely has to go for a bulk up or something or substitute. Mm -hmm. 
just four attacking moves. Okay, so it's Dark Fighting, Flying Electric. One, two. So that's Electric. Let's see, Fighting. One, two. Let's see, Dark. One, two. And Flying. Okay. Flying cannot come. I know it goes fucking unchecked versus his team, but this shit is not dying to flying type attacks anyway. Let's do close combat knockoff, because that order makes more sense to me. And for my last move, don't need fire. And I can't bring an ice type attack on this Pokemon, obviously. Do I have play rough? It's not bad. Or do I just bring bulk up or something? I don't really love bulk up on this Pokemon though, but the mere idea of setting up is pretty important. What else would I bring? Okay, there's his challenge. Ah. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Scratch. Do I bring Volt Switch versus how many ground types? Or no, versus, yeah, two electric immunities. Maybe I bring Sub. No, I don't. I think we run this. Ah, do I bring Volt Switch? Fuck. Yeah. What am I play roughing? Zygarde. Oh, and Iron Hands. I'll bring, I'll bring, I'll, 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 I'll bring it. I'll bring it. I'll bring it. No second guessing. Good thing I'm not bringing Acrobatics. Hopefully I don't regret saying that literally out loud right before I click accept. Natural Cure turns into Pixelate. It would be crazy if he brings Weather, because his Pidgeot definitely wants Rain, but I don't think he's bringing it. Levitate, Vault Absorb. Let's double check there's no crazy abilities I need to be freaked out about. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, I have to double check what these do in case it comes, but I'll check once I'm in the match. I'm pretty sure both are pretty powerful. And... Versus Adam. Let's accept. Ooh. Wigglytuff came... Uh, I hope the music isn't crazy loud for you guys, because it's extremely quiet for me. Let's see if I can zoom in once, so that you guys can get a slightly prettier view of the action. I've been realizing that my videos are mad zoomed out. Um, good luck, have fun. He probably won't respond, because he's on mobile. Um, <coughs> oh, he did respond. So my lead, he has Landorus. I think I still just want to lead this, right? Dude, wait, being zoomed in is really psyching me out, actually. Um. Let's stick with the plan. He has no Chiyu. It's Landorus. But I'm fine with it. I think I am. Did I already lose? Why do I feel like I already lost? Let's click Reflect. He misses Stone Edge 100% of the time, or you just click Stealth Rock. Oh, he's slow. He's slow. Hmm. He needs a ground type attack here. What does Thousand Arrows do? Oh, it can turn into a ground, normal, and fighting type Pokemon. Ground normal fighting. Let's intimidate it. Ground. Thousand arrows. Thank you, reflect. Maybe we start with trailblaze. Long reach is no contact, right? Yeah. More likely overgrow. Will this kill? 
I'm fine with investing Terrestrial now, because I definitely want it versus this team. He brought he brought both of these, and his Terra remains... He has 4x Ice Weakness. Dead. Pretty good. Now it's very awkward for him to switch in. He probably wants to bring in Iron Hands for Fighting Type, but... Let's check out Aqua. Terra Ice versus... What do you bring out? Yeah, Iron Hands. <sighs> Earthquake Super doesn't kill. Super doesn't kill. And Close Combat Super kills me. Huh, what's my answer to this? Do I go here? Even if you use an electric type attack, well, it can be fighting or electric. None of those Pokemon are chipped yet, just one dead. This would be a good time to have bulk up. I think I want to go Waverly Place, or, ha, uh, but this thing has, let's try it. Okay, good, good, good. Gonna click Will-O-Wisp. <coughs> what does this thing have? Cute Charm, Competitive Frisk. And I brought, okay, thank god I didn't bring Blunder Policy or whatever it's called, yeah. Oh, oh, please burn. Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Do I just... Oh my god, I hate using inaccurate moves. Um, uh... Landorus. What do you want to click versus me? Let's bring up Miss Magius. Shadow Ball can do half. I think I just want to click it. You're burned, reflected. Oh, knock off. Knock off. Shadow Ball did 32. If I click Shadow Ball again, he's going to go one of those two, I think. Let's go Rotom. And set up screens again. Oh, good thing I did it now. Reflect. I don't care about that. Light screen. <sighs> don't go ground type. Don't go ground type. Don't go ground type. I just want to be able to click Vault Switch. What do you do here? Wait. Wait. What does this Pokemon do? Um, no viable strategies, love that. Oh, wish teleport. Okay, that's stupid. Can this tell me more information? Teleport baton pass, heal bell, wish, stealth rock, taunt knockoff, thief covet, pain split, seismic toss, toxic. Let's vault switch. That did a lot of damage, weirdly. Maybe I go this Pokemon, because this is like... Or I go... No, it's Rapid Spin. And, and I can't be status. That literally did zero. <coughs> what?! That's how much Rapid Spin does?! Huh? Let's just go Altaria. Surely you protect. If you Dazzling Gleam, I think I'm kind of potentially still find it anyway. Uh, do you protect? Hmm. Yeah, it would have been a good time to bring a, uh, I'll just, I'll just hard go Altaria. The worst that happens is I have to switch out immediately, but I think you're going to try and click protect. Oh, hello. Very much hello. I'm 219 speed, so you can't outspeed me, but you might be Choice Scarf, but I have Reflect. Okay, I go first. 
Um, Dragon Dance, reflect for two more turns. Um, Roost before Reflect wears off. Or Dragon Dance before Reflect wears off. He has no Ditto, so this is starting to look like Lights Out. Maybe I just Dragon Dance again. Keep the returns going. Uh, I think I want to Roost, weirdly. Let's Dragon Dance. Oh, he's still thinking about that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Kenneke. Heavy Slam, no crit. Love that. We're going to return. If he was Focus Sash, that would have sucked so bad. You probably go Landorus to Intimidate, right? But I outspeed already, so this might be a sweep. <coughs> I was fishing for the crit. Yeah, haha. -ha. I think his crit might still not kill me. You could, can you low roll a crit to do... Like, if you do 85%... You know what I'm saying? You can do 85 to 100% of your actual attack. So like, 85 to 100. No way it mattered. Are you kidding? Wait. Altaria. Uh, Skyline. Let's do plus 2 attack versus Iron Hands. Are you... Huh? Guaranteed 3 hit KO. Wait, it actually mattered that much? That's crazy. Attack plus 2, return. Wow, it might have super mattered. That's crazy. I wonder... Wait, is he is he 252 defense? Because if so, it super mattered. You're, you, you don't outspeed me. Even if Alteria dies, I'm fine with it at this point. Oh, crit e-speed? Oh, that would've been crazy, though. Uh. <laughs> oh, it was a guaranteed Oko. What was I doing wrong with my... Oh. Oh, there we go. Um. Oops. Return. Oh, the Intimidate. Yeah, you should've done that earlier, I think. Um... Just click return. GG's. Woo! We did it! That was pretty surgical. We actually got a 6-0 sweep. Um, we got... Wow. Did we get lucky? I think we got lucky in team building more than we got in the gameplay. Screen's Rotom went fucking hard here. Um, yeah. GG's that in. Um, Merry Christmas to everyone who celebrated. Woo, GG's. We go up 4-0, and let's see if we can go 5-0 versus Alex uh, later on. Wish me luck in finishing my thesis for NYU, and um, sweet dreams, everyone. Bye.